I'm Kerry Stanley. And I'm Dolly Diamond. Dolly, we've been let out. Where oh, are we? I know. <gasps> we are very, very excited because we've got a very special guest. I can see. Oh, <gasps> Your Excellency. Oh. <laughs> Lovely to see you yeah. both. Hello. You, should we call you that? Is you like that? Oh, you can call me whatever you like. Oh. It's just fine. Or the governor. What about the governor? Governor's right. governor. 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 We are yes. very thrilled to be here in such a beautiful establishment, of course, is Governor. House. I mean, how many years have you been here and do you still feel the magic in this place? I've been here five and a half years and the magic never eludes me. Love that. You know, there is not a moment when I drive up that driveway and see that gorgeous house, I never feel it's normal. It's still special every single time. And it's so lovely to be welcoming people here again. Well, that's really lovely as well. And we, we you know, we, we, what we did look to make sure we were invited and that we didn't just break in. <laughs> we, we didn't want No, that, we wanted we? to play by the rules. We've been yeah. doing that every, you know, every yeah. step of the way. But you, you love this, you love opening it up to, to almost everybody, don't we? We really house. do. That's what it's here for. This is the house for all Victorians. And we like to use it in every possible way and to use every inch of it. So the last six months or so has been difficult because, like everyone, we've done everything virtually. So I'm excited that as we begin to open, we begin to welcome people back here again. That's gorgeous, isn't yeah. it? Do you ever wonder what you would be doing if you weren't the governor? What would you, you know? Oh, dear. Well, um, you know, I always wanted to be a social worker. But I was too young to start that course at university. They let me start law instead. Apparently, you don't need as much maturity and wisdom. I'm not sure about <laughs> right. that, but that appeared to be the rule at the time. So I did law for about 40 years, and I loved that. What else would I love to be doing? Well, I'd love to be a footballer. I adore football. Really? But have you seen the size of me when I stand up? I know. Well, you could be you fast, could, fast yes. and nifty. You could, yes. you could really sing around there. How about being small and slow? That doesn't go well together. Well, maybe you could be on the cheer squad. I mean, your your CV reads like it's, it's mind-blowing how much you've actually you've done. You're, you know, your passion lies. In, across so many sectors, the arts, football, you've done all of that. Definitely. Which is wonderful. Like, in amongst all of these things as governor, have you had any kind of aha moments? Like, Aww. those real pinch-me moments you go, well, oh, this is pretty cool. It oh. might it might be now. Oh, that's it? It must um, be right now. Apart from today. Isn't that funny? That's what I was going oh, to say I've first. Oh, I've ruined it. Uh, oh, I'm what sorry. What a coincidence. So, I'm having one right now. Gorgeous. Right, we like that. Right. Well done, thank you. Now, apart from today. Yes. Look, there's been many of them. Some of them you'd expect. So when we host royals or, you know, Hillary Clinton, state um, visits from leaders around the world, they're, they're exciting and interesting. But so many of the aha moments are things that you wouldn't expect. So one of my favourite events that we do every year is an event for all the centenarians, all the people who've turned 100 oh, for that year. Can you imagine how lovely that is to have their wisdom and their interesting comments all in one room yes. in the house? I've been to events like, I don't know if either of you were at the um, T20 women's cricket, the ICC cricket, just before we closed down for COVID. It was International Women's Day. That's right. The MCG was packed. Yes. And lots of women in the crowd. And that was a real aha moment to see a record crowd of women yes. at the G. So my aha moments go on and on. I meet so many amazing people in our community and many of the events here and around the state give me those moments. Oh, no, fantastic. Did you yeah. get up and dance to Katie? I might have. Really I might have done a little bit. I might not. have. Yes. It was pretty good. It's a song I love, and I love working out to that song. Now yes. you know all my secrets. What's so. your regime? What my do you regime. Do? Well, I actually love walking, but I make myself do a bit of gym work too. Because you know, you look at Ruth Bader Ginsburg, and she yes. was still going strong with those weights. Oh, and yes. so that's an inspiration. We're we 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 And there's, there's some good hills amongst here too, so you could really get that cardio. This is, up. you know, this land was known as, or the house was known as the house on the hill so it is a little bit hilly around here which is beautiful and aren't we all going to look forward to more and more outdoor activities yeah. it's going to yes. be fantastic we're ready well we appreciate the outdoors i think in a way that we, we might yes. not always have done before I know my lounge room now, I know my bedroom, because <laughs> mine's a little bit like, you know, the, the, 
different. Just different. <laughs> We're thinking of knocking through, though. You know. What, into ours? Into, would you mind? <laughs> yes, I would. <laughs> when we were first chatting about coming to visit you, and, um, and well, of course, we've, we have been in parts of the house. Not all parts of the house, no. only, you know. How much of the stamp can you put on in a house like that? That has got so much history. Do you know, I think the joy of this role is you can put your stamp on the house and the role. So every governor does it differently according to their own personality, according to their own interests. So you look back through history and you know that governors have added wonderful things to the house or garden, but even more importantly, wonderful things to the program. So I've taken on patronages, for example, that other governors haven't had but they suit my particular interests. And I've run events that other governors haven't run, but that's nothing against them. They ran events that I don't run. Right. Yeah. And that's the joy of this role. And I would imagine in that way, everybody gets a bit of a look in, doesn't it? They it was really always do. exactly the same. Exactly. You know. And you know what's important to me is we're the temporary custodians of a very important role that serves the community. And so it's not about us. It's about what we do during that time. And then we pass it on. Like yes. a like a relay race. Yes, no, that's I love a good that. Race. That's a great look. I it. am lucky enough to be an ambassador with guide dogs, and I know they're one of yours, aren't they? They certainly are. And you've got the list. If you look at that list, yes. is enormous. That list is incredible. So I've got a lot of work to do. Yeah, yeah. Well, you're halfway you know. there, honey. I mean, I know you. You really. I'll give it a go, don't <laughs> you I? Do. So you know, these patronages are really important, and they run through the history of Government House. There's always been um, organisations that the governors have supported. Guide Dogs are a wonderful example yeah. of a much-loved organisation in this state. And you and I know what they do yeah. for people with any sight problems and how they open up their lives yes. to independent living. Yeah. We've got big patronages like the Red Cross. My husband's actually the patron because all the previous partners who've been wives have been the patron. So he's taken that one on. But there are some very small organisations too, and there's another one we actually have in common, which is the Pinnacle Foundation. Yes. Yeah, that's a great foundation. My, my, one of my best friends is on the committee for that. Yes. So that's an example of one that I took on that hadn't been involved at Government House before, and it's very dear to me. It's an organisation, as you both know, that looks after LGBTI yeah. plus kids. And we've had many of these young people here at the house. I've seen firsthand what Pinnacle's doing for them mentoring them, giving them scholarships, giving them confidence. Yes. Mm. And just making them realise they're normal, valued members of our community, whatever they might have endured or been through yeah. until mm. then. So I love that organisation. Isn't that just lovely to be in that position where you not only get to be um, involved, but you get to see the value yeah. of that involvement? And with organisations like that, that, that are self-funded or they're not... You know, they re rely on yeah. donations, of course, too. So to shine the light on them is so essential, isn't it? But that's such a good expression, Kerry, because shining the light on wonderful organisations and wonderful people is absolutely core to this role. So I spend a lot of my day meeting terrific people and saying thank you. I mean, what a way to spend your life. Yes. That's amazing. And how important is that for the community to know that good work is valued? Yes. So I'm very lucky. Touched on earlier about your CV being how long? Enormous. Incredible. Do you get much downtime? Because it seems like you'd fill it with so many amazing projects and your passion, your passions. What does the downtime look like for you? Okay, so let me go back to the beginning. I, like so many Victorians, have one of my parents was born overseas, so I come from that migrant background. My father never left me in any doubt as to how lucky we were to be living in such a safe, wonderful community. And I was left in no doubt too that we had to give back. So for me, that concept of doing things in the community and with the community, it's relaxing, it's, it's good, it's what I love to do and it's what nourishes me. So I don't take a lot of downtime, but it doesn't feel like I'm working, it never feels like work. So if I'm absolutely being quiet and um, trying to relax, I walk. So yeah, I do love a good movie. What have you been watching? Oh. You, you name something that I haven't been watching. First of all, half of what I've watched I couldn't tell you, like I shouldn't I know. tell you, and I will yes. never tell you. <laughs> um, and the other half, look, I have watched every documentary, I yes. have watched every the series. Octopus. The Octopus oh, was exciting. Yes. 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 Yeah. Wasn't it wonderful? And I've got one to recommend, Phoenix Rising. 
Ooh. about now it's about the Paralympics. It's one of the most oh, beautifully I've seen it. made. Yeah, isn't it it's exquisite? Amazing. No, yeah. yeah, amazing. There you go. So I've just yeah. promoted another product. Oh yeah. no, but it's a wonderful story. Yeah. yeah. I mean, the other thing I love to relax is family, and that's what we are yearning. Everyone's yes. yearning to get back to. Now it is a huge where you live. It's absolutely enormous. Have you ever considered getting it on Airbnb? <laughs> <laughs> you would get a thrill, wouldn't you? Well, as I, you I imagine. Arrive. Arrived and you think, oh, mm, this will do. Yes. Look, um, I'd love to do that. First of all, it's not mine to give, but more importantly, we use every bit of this house. You know, we've got a beautiful vegetable garden down one part of the property where we have refugee and newly arrived women coming in who are a little bit isolated socially and they come in and spend time here together across a school oh, term. Wonderful. We've used the lawn just beyond here for young kids to, to camp out to learn about healthy living and healthy lifestyle. And our ballroom gets used for every conceivable award ceremony, investiture, and then some. Yes. So we've had um, circus performers in there with the, the high trapeze artists performing with young kids who've just freshly arrived from overseas. Um, we've had concerts for young people. We really do try to use every part of the house in the most creative ways for the community. There was the Ida Hobbit reception. Yes. We were here. Yes. yes. Yeah. I mean, how was that? Something like 800 people in that ballroom mm. looking great and just so much fun to be welcoming that group into this mm. house, the State House. Yes, there was that one little area right where you were that was roped off oh, and was it was it? like almost like a throne <laughs> and I was I was I was close I was so near you wanted to I wanted on that you that wanted you to be on that and now you know why it was roped off yes <laughs> there you go <laughs> She's got me. She knows yes, me. Yes, we know that you do. You, be, warned. you want to be monarchy, don't I you, darling? Do. <laughs> do you? Do. Yeah, well. Queen of Moomba. Queen of Moomba. Oh. oh, we have so much in common. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> well, we loved our little natter today. So did I. Yes, and, uh, thank we, you we, so we, very I don't much. Know, yeah, we've got anything else, because it's our only oh, opportunity. I we think, may not I think, I think one last question yes. to you, Governor, is, so what next? What yeah. next? <laughs> how, how, how long? I know it's a very broad, how long's a piece of string? But okay. How long, you know? Do you want to know, honestly, what I would love to do? Yes. yes. Okay. <laughs> you made me going? anxious. That was a bit too keen. No, uh, we're not, yeah. No, what I will do and what I would love to do are yeah. two different All things. Right. What I will do is just keep going with the community work, whether I'm governor or not. Yeah. It's, it's my, my absolute love. What I would love to do, I'd love to be an interviewer. Really? Oh. I am so genuinely curious about people and so enjoy hearing their stories, their yes. ideas, their points of view. I want to do what you're doing. And you and you make that mention of that that we answered very quickly. <laughs> that's that's why we are genuinely interested. Yes. And we've been very lucky that we only um, have anyone on with us that we really want them to be there. Yes. You know, we yeah. love that and we love what we do as we are, well. We're born curious as well. Like that's yeah. very much so. It's so. the key. Yes. It's Isn't the key. It? Yes. Yeah, to everything. Can I thank both of you for what you do generally, but also for being kind to me today? Oh, oh no. it's happy it hours was with very, our very pleasure. easy and we were warned. <laughs> <laughs> well, it went well then from that point of view. <laughs> really well. You're absolutely delightful. Thank yes, you. Thank, thank you very you. much for joining us. Thank you to you too. Yeah, no, yeah. you're well. Yeah, no, it's lovely. They've just watched it now. Yeah, it's great. good, wasn't thank it? Thank you so much. All our love. Yeah, we'll be yeah, in the big room. Yes. Moving in. Lovely. All right. <laughs> <laughs> oh.